Hey darling, we're back with another Hubby Dub video. Today we're working on Behold the Lord, day three. Beautiful perfection. Point it out so you can see what we're doing. Um, we have the, like a little traveler's um, notepad. We have some sticky notes with some notes on it, of course, because it's sticky notes. Uh, with some Bible verses, three of them, I'm just showing you guys. And we are going to be using some stamps, so like a lighthouse, some grass, some um, look like watercolor paint. So we're going to take out the stamps and we're going to put them on the block getting a massage we're going to massage the stamps because they're going to work got to be nice to them before we start and some more massaging because it looks like they're really going to be work working today we're adding some black ink to the lighthouse and light this is a very nice design art i really do like it um we're angling placing it Making sure we got it where we wanted it to be. First stamp that wasn't as dark as we wanted, so we're gonna go over it again. And we're grabbing some, some more stamps, some more massaging, add some ink, and uh, this is don't know the technical technical term, but it look like you know the grass or the stuff that grows at the beaches. Um, got some clouds. You know, a little cloudy day. Uh, adding some more clouds. Taking them off. Uh, we're getting some smaller clouds. A little massage. You know, can't have all the same clouds. Not as realistic. So we add some smaller ones. Different areas. Lighter to give it some depth. Which is a very nice touch. So now we are using watercolor and with the pen that has water in it and this is a very cool device to tell you the truth makes watercolor in a lot easier i'm gonna take some blue we're gonna get to the water first you know add adding some blue like bluish gray which is kind of realistic to the water it makes it look like the water is cold not like tropical type of water um, adding some more color to it, added some shading, now it looks like a little bit of gray, some, a little splatter around for the splash effect. Now we are coloring the rocks with more watercolor. Um, as you can see, looks like all you got to do is just squeeze the pin to get the water out. Um, the more you squeeze, the more, you know, darker the color co um, becomes because you add more water to it. Still painting the rocks. Now we're outlining that, what it looks like, which is cool, which is actually a very nice technique. Makes it pop out a little bit. Now we're going to start uh, coloring in the lighthouse, starting off with the windows. And uh, giving this a nice little tan color, golden tan. Um, get around the doors, you know. And well, actually, we're gonna color the doors too. We're gonna color all of it. And now we have another little pack with some more colors. Ooh, add some gold. Uh, now the gold makes it look really good. Makes certain parts of the lighthouse pop out. Um, and a little bit of brown. I want to say brown. I might be wrong. It might be black. But it looks brown to me. Um, then we're going to add the same tan to the, to the uh, grass, sea grass thing in Madrid. Put in the comments, what, what what's the technical term for the vegetation on the sea? Now, we're going to add some um, 
paint the middle with the blue. You know, give, give the water a little bit more details. Outline the water so you can actually see the wave splashing against the lighthouse. Looking really good. Between the art and the coloring, I, I really like this. Just, it really looks good to me. Um, so now we're going to add the beauty card. Isaiah 3317. Um, put some of this glue on the back. Make sure it sticks. Now we're going to see which pole we want to use. We're going to use this one. And... I'm going to be truthful, y'all. Jessica has very beautiful handwriting. But in this video right now, I don't, I, I don't know what she's writing. I'm not going to lie to you. I'm just being so truthful. So, um, you know, go ahead. Make fun of me. It's okay. Now we're going to get some of these stickers with the letters. Uh, let's see. We're going to start off. You're formulating some words. I can see it says your eyes will. I'm going to just let the rest be get spelled out before. Because then I'm going to just be speaking slowly. Let's see what's going on. Adding stickers, making sure it's light. We're going to add a different type of sticker to emphasize the word king. All right. And go back to the old stickers. And we're going to use some different stickers to emphasize this word. Which beauty... Don't know why she spelt it like that. Like, started from the middle out, but it's beauty. So, all together we get, Your eyes will behold the king and his beauty. Isaiah 33, 17. Like I said, I love Jessica handwriting. But in this video, um, I can't see it. I'm just being truthful, y'all. I'm trying to be as transparent as possible. And today in this video... I can't read out what she's writing. Beautiful handwriting, though. Uh, we're going to get some more st stamps. Let's see what we got. We got some seagulls to get a little massage. They're not doing too much work, so they just get, like, one little massage. Two seagulls. Because, you know, they don't fly alone. They they, they fly in packs. Get the, get the gray water coloring. Give it some shade and... Man, this is a very, very, very beautiful page. Hope you enjoyed this video. And make sure you check out the girl's other hubby dub videos. Bye.